my body his present too. Won't be needing this anymore. I'm done fighting. You're all that matters to me now, so I'm gonna stay right here with you. My friend will know what to do with this one. Well, Merry Christmas. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> oh, okay. Thanks, Mads Mickelson, Santa Claus. Definitely not unintentionally scary. Okay. Uh, friends, denizens of the internet, hello, welcome back to another exciting episode of Death Stranding Director's Cut over here at Lost Time Gaming. I'm Devo, we are jumping back into the shoes of Sam Porter Bridges, and, uh, yeah, I wasn't expecting that. Also, as weird as that was, that actually kind of makes a weird amount of sense, because we've seen that little, uh, spaceman skeleton guy before. Now, the real question is, is that we didn't see it in the same kind of, uh, fashion that we saw it there when we saw it before. I believe one of the, it was the body disposal guy that we meet in the beginning was carrying it. But, you know, that's another layer to the story that is Death Stranding. Now, we have to get out of here, obviously. Our best bet is basically go halfway and use a zipline, if we're going to be honest. <laughs> And now, so if, I don't think we have another zip line. Let's see, we carry another PCC. It doesn't, doesn't look like it. Okay, so let's know, Can Sam. I myself? <laughs> Sam, there's, I mean, you probably did. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, activate terminal. Can we make... A PCC level two. Yes. Good. Thank you very much. Yes, load it on my spine with the rest of my goods. Right. And it's weird that we get we got uh, Santa Claus uh, Mads Mickelson instead of like Pumpkinhead Mads Mickelson. It was kind of a uh, it's just like two holidays off, Mads. It's okay. Now we can double check the general direction where we're going, which is going to be this way, I guess. Slightly to the left. Basically, once we see our adjoining zip line, we should probably just try and build one. Because, yeah, it is only a 300 meter reach. So how far away is that? At 500 meters. Okay, whoa, why are, we, why are we creeping down the hill? That's not necessary. Oh, and also, I want that one across... Across the river. That's weird. Maybe I'm not looking at the map correctly. I'm kind of having a bad day, so if I'm making a terrible life choices... Just let me know, because, well, that's, that's the name of the game, so to speak. 
So this is where we're supposed to go. Oh, I think maybe that's it over there. Way over there. No, nope, I've got to learn that you have to break. Can I zoom in? That didn't really help. Thanks. Maybe we can just use this zip line to go across to another zip line? I, I don't know. But in reality, I feel like we should probably just probably just cross at that bridge over there. Just uh Because that zip line there probably goes somewhere, but who knows where, as there's a massive river. Yeah, let's just go to the bridge. It's out of the way, but bridges are nice and easy. Woo! Oh, 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 Sam, that's unfortunate. Woo! Nailed it. That was a cliff, not a general decline. And now, we're going hard right, I want to say. Yep. Well, that's only a couple hundred meters. Let's see if we can't get on the rocks here and build ourselves a zip line over here, maybe. Yeah, climb them rocks. Yeah, definitely not what this was intended to do, but hey. Oh, there's the chiral network line. Yeah, come on. Just a little, little more. No, maybe not. All right. Well, tried it twice and it didn't work. Maybe over here. Yeah, there we go. I get the feeling we're going to be just shy where we need to be to build a zipline here. Yeah, look at that. 320 meters. That's terrible. Let's get right up to the line. No, don't urinate, Sam. We don't need you peeing. Again. Wait, oh. No, oh, that's not the camera. How, how, how close are we to that? 29 meters off. That's terrible. <laughs> and I want to say... Probably get no leeway with that either. Yeah, 327 meters. Yep. Yeah. Brutal. Simply brutal. Guess I don't really have a solution for that, because that means we got to go up and over that giant mountain face there. Which I guess isn't, uh, too bad, I guess. I'm not going to get very far on the bike trying to get over that, though. Especially because I'm just, I've been having a week where my brain is just not working, and it's, it's unpleasant, to say the least. I have been working hard doing uh, Halloween bonus episodes for the week come or this week coming up, and I forgot to announce that because I'm a doofus, as stated, having the rough week. Um, so you should be seeing uh, the first one should be coming out today alongside, um, well, this episode of Death Stranding. So I hope you enjoy it. They're nothing too crazy, but you know I I always enjoy uh, getting into the Halloween spirit. I've always been a big fan of Halloween, even as a kid. Even when I was afraid of pretty much everything, I still enjoyed Halloween for some reason. I'm not sure why, but it's true. Hmm. Something tells me we're going down in there. We're not getting back out again. Well, let's give it a go anyway, I guess. Oh, hello. Found a person living down here. Should probably at least pop in and say hello. Um, oh, there's there's no one here apparently. That's all right. I'm sure someone will be here eventually. Yeah, we might be able to get the bike up out of there. Maybe. What we really need to do is be like heading up just behind that rock face, but as you can see, there is a giant rock face, and 
we're not going up the giant rock base, or are we? Nope. Yep, yep. Almost. Come on. Yep. Yep. Oh, come on. There we go. That's the ticket. Ow. Does that have a mule sensor over there? That's unfortunate. Oh, this can be so difficult sometimes. Oh, we got connected to the chiral network again. We got some mail. You know, it's sad. My, I have a, I have an email account, right? As does pretty much everyone in this day and age. But the only thing I use it for is to, uh, like, get deals on stuff that I buy. <laughs> it's of no use apart from that. <laughs> For the longest time, I swear, I only used it for, uh, to get free games from Humble Bundle, but they don't do that anymore, so there's, it's one less reason I need to use it. Wait, is that where we're going? I think we're where we need to be, yeah. Yep, right over this way. It seems like we'll be able to take some, uh, take some zip lines on our way out of here, but... All right, stop under the time fall shelter, as you do. <sighs> All right, Mama. How's things going? How's your floating ghost baby? I didn't even like saying that. Thanks for coming back. Got something for you. These are your new cufflinks. They still work as a terminal, but I've added a weapon function. I was able to redesign everything from the ground up after the last connection. And they're weapons too now. That's right. Cord cutters. I should explain. BTs are connected to the other side via umbilical cords, right? When those cords bring the matter of our world into contact with the antimatter of theirs, boom, void off. But, just as Dead Man theorized, your blood does have unique properties. It can be used to cut a BT's cord. So, I've added that function. Cut the cord of the BT, and it returns to the world of the dead. No BT, no void out. Win-win. These things can cut them loose. If you can get close enough without them noticing, yes. Cord snipping super handcuffs. Right. Let's try them out. Cut the cord connecting us. She's sound asleep. I made sure she got plenty of milk. Just do it. Please, Sam. Set us free. This world was never hers, but all the same, I didn't want her to leave it. Even though she's already lost. Truth is, she's not really my daughter. The attack and everything, that was all a lie? No. That part was true. My ovaries can't produce eggs, and Lochna has trouble with her uterus. 
Long story short, neither of us can have children. I was all right with it. I mean, <laughs> children, who needs them, I thought. But my sister thought differently. Lachna wanted a child, someone to carry her genes. She fell in love with another member of Bridges, but he died in an accident. She was devastated, of course, as was I. Back then, strong emotions like that, I could feel hers and she could feel mine. When I sensed her desire to join him, to end it, I went to her and said, let's have a baby. We took one of Lachna's eggs and fertilized it with his frozen sperm. And I carried it to term. A healthy baby grew inside of me. But then there was the attack. And our bond was severed. I wanted to tell her. But I was bound to the child. I couldn't just abandon her. But I was wrong. Lachna needs to know. You have to break some ties to forge others. Keep me tied to everything. If we're going to reconnect the world, I need to reconnect with my sister first. So please, Sam. Do it. Sam, would you set me up? I haven't been outside in a long time. It's just too much to take in all at once. Are you sure? I thought you might be claustrophobic after your time in the rubble. I'll be fine, so long as I can see out of the bag. The warmth, the light touch of the wind, the scent of the world. Lucky you. The two of you are still connected. Okay, Sam. Let's go. Oh, yeah, that's cool. I'll just leave all my stuff there. That's fine. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I, I guess. Um, now, the real problem... Well, 
I had a special surprise prepped and everything. But it looks to me like your hands are full. <laughs> no biggie. You can always tweak the rules a bit. not get eaten. Sound like fun? Of course it does. Run, Sam, run! Oh, oh, okay. Uh, yeah, we'll just run now. Uh, we'll run in the run direction. Uh, that was not the correct direction, Sam. Oh, yeah, Sam, this is not how you don't get eaten. I just wouldn't throw that out there, Sam. This is how you get eaten, in, in case you were not aware. I don't know if I can climb up this. Oh, no, Sam. Sam can't climb any higher than that. That is unfortunate. Uh, thankfully, the... The tentacle lion has uh, decided to go the other direction. I don't know what that is, but it sounds terrible. Let's get away from that. Ah, yes, into the goop. A totally sound strategy that will not get us killed on any level. Oh, wait, no, I'm sorry, the opposite. This will get us killed. <laughs> Spewing evil lasers. Good. That's that's what I always wanted. Oh, that's and that's how we die, like that. Oh, I can't double jump while I'm carrying a person on my back. That's shocking. There we go. You got it, Sam. Oh, I don't know what that is, but it sounds bad. Uh, th oh, I was gonna say, thankfully there's a highway here, but, uh, crap. Oh, oh it's, it's gone now. Yeah, but everything's like a oily wasteland still. Oh no, it's fine. Wait, what? Oh, it's all good now. Okay. What direction was I even heading? I don't know. I was definitely not heading in the right direction. I guess I kind of was. Either way, we should probably just go get our stuff. Or not our stuff, our, uh, our bike rather. Oh, dead fish, lovely. Man, the, the, the thousands of dead fish have to smell very pleasant. Ooh, let's hit it. You say right on? Nice. That's what cool people say. Uh, no, we need to basically go hard left. Oh, we basically need to go this way, apparently. <laughs> well, the real question is, can we get lucky and have there be a zip line attached to this one? I'm gonna say no. Because it seems like we weren't very lucky on our uh, on our way through here before. Oh, this is actually Mama's zipline. That's fun. Uh, use zipline.
368 meters. Terrible. And there's no other zip lines worth getting here. You know what? I wonder if that's out of the chiral network or not. Probably, yeah. I was gonna say it'd probably make a lot of sense just to put one there to get us over the bridge. We don't have to go back the way we came, but it looks like we're just going to have to go back the way we came. All right, well, we'll figure that out in the next episode, because that's all the time I have for this episode today. Thank you, everybody, so much for joining me on another exciting look into the world of Death Stranding Director's Cut. I am Devo at Lost Time Gaming. If you enjoyed the video today, feel free to leave a like, leave a comment, get subscribed. Let me know down in the comment section below what you thought about my gameplay, my commentary, or anything else in general. That being said, thanks for watching, and as usual... I'll catch you all on the flip side.